sir. Thank you. How are you feeling? A bit nervous, very nervous, in fact. Big deal. I don't want to let myself down. No, you won't. I look really sweaty, is that all right? <laughs> all looks better already. Yeah. Do the edges then. Yeah, yeah. And the right, the top of the forehead. Great morning. How you doing, okay? Good, yeah. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> really nervous. Nervous. But yeah, yeah, yeah. Good, good, yeah. You know, we were talking the other day, you know, like when you can feel a good audience even before you walk out. I could feel it. Yeah, definitely. Hello. Hello, Mark, is it? Yeah, you didn't do it. You're right, mate. I'm all right, lad. I'm all right. You were the same year. Judges' houses, Simon's house. That's right, mate. Yeah, I was in a group called The Reason. You still speak to the other lads? Oh, yeah, mate. Yeah, we're really good friends. So. Okay, that's good. That's sure. good. Um, <laughs> <laughs> and what happened to make you go out on your own and leave The Reason behind? We sung for about two years after the show, um, but then unfortunately it didn't work out. So we all went back to work, got jobs. I'm married now with a wife, a uh, two year old beautiful daughter. Aww. And, uh, and I'm a fireman at Southampton Airport. So. Oh, cool. Oh, wow. Good lad. My name is Mark Higgins, I'm 36 and I'm a firefighter. Uh, I entered the show in 2010 with a group called The Reason. And you are... I'm Mark Higgins and I'm 28. We had a really good first audition, got through boot camp, got all the way to the judges' houses in Marbella. And obviously it was a year that the One Direction lads were on the show. They got the yes, we got the no. It's bad news, boys. Me and the boys were absolutely distraught. Watching the 1D lads go to superstardom kind of made you feel like, oh, that could have been us. Last time I saw Louis was eight years ago. It's going to be a really strange moment seeing that Louis is now a judge uh, and he's now judging me. I believe in myself. I want to show the judges what I can do and I really hope they like it. This is the dream. This is why I'm here eight years later, but I still don't want to give up. I don't think anybody should give up on their dream. And uh, how old are you now, Mark? I'm 36 now, so... Wow! <laughs> OK, OK. And what are you going to sing today? I'm going to sing Careless Whisper. OK, well, good luck. Thank you very much. Good luck, man. Um, this is really difficult for me. It did just feel a little karaoke and dated at times, and I was really rooting for you, lad, but it just didn't do it for me, I'm afraid. Mark, I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, this is going to be almost impossible to work. OK. For you, your age, you're not writing your own material, the chances of getting a grade A writer to write something for you would be actually impossible. Okay. So I don't, I don't want to give you any false hope whatsoever, but I don't see this happening. Sorry, mate. I appreciate the opportunity, guys. Okay. Thanks for Thank coming. You. Thank you. Cheers. Cheers. Thanks, Tom. You did. Seriously, you did yourself proud. You did us proud. Oh, just hard. Yeah. It's like sliding doors, you just see. Yeah, I know what you mean. The next person we see better be good. <laughs> <laughs> 